Boyd's Hardwood Gun Stocks. Hi, I'm Randy Boyd. Should you free float your barrel channel? That's when you have clearance between your barrel and the gun stock. There's been a lot of debate on this subject over the years. Some people think that you should free float it. You may have heard running a dollar bill between the stock and the forend, but yet others talk that you should glue a pressure pad up on the forend. Well, these both could be right, but yet they could be wrong. Let me explain. When you shoot a firearm, the bullet and gas is traveling through the barrel cause the barrel to move. This movement can vary depending on barrel diameter, caliber, stability of the stock, and so forth. Example is here with the 300 Magnum two-piece stock and forend and a sporter barrel. This has more movement than a lighter caliber 223 with a heavy barrel and classic style stock. This movement can cause a collision between the stock and barrel of which can change your point of impact. So, should you free float or use a pressure pad? With a pressure pad, even the slightest movement in the barreled action or stock will cause changes to your point of impact. And with some firearms, the barrel will bounce off the stock. Our testing has shown for longer term accuracy, it's best to free float your barrel between 20 to 40 thousandths, far more than a dollar bill. This eliminates any opportunity for the stock and the barrel to collide. One of the top causes for an inconsistent shooting rifle is a non-free floated barrel channel. This is an easy fix and you can do it using dowels and sandpaper or scrapers. Just something to get you the 20 to 40 thousandths of clearance around the barrel. One last important note, with most firearms when assembling it's possible to hold the barrel either right or left when you tighten the action screws. Don't expect it to pull the barrel to the center because in most cases it will stay where you tighten it at. This can cause the barrel to lose its free float. To completely eliminate this, you may want to watch our bedding video. So remember, in most cases a free floated stock with a 20 to 40 thousandths clearance will prevent stock and barrel collision and improve your accuracy. I'm Randy Boyd. Thanks for watching.